Hello everyone, and if you are watching this, today is the first day of the new year, so happy new year. I hope you guys had a great 2018, and I'm back. So I took a little break, and it was really nice. Um, I just enjoyed the holidays with my family, and I hope you guys did too. But I'm going to start this video, um, my first video, sorry, that's my phone. I'm going to start my first video of the new year with a Q&A. So I know these can get a little bit boring and um, I don't know, like a lot of people that are subscribed to my channel already know who I am, but I'm going to do a Q&A while I do my makeup. So I have 371 questions to choose from. I'm not going to do all 371, um, just the basic ones and while I get ready with you guys. So, because it's a new year, it's time for changes. So, subscribe to my channel. Change your life. <laughs> no, for real, guys. Um, subscribe to my channel if you want. And I try to post videos every Tuesday and Thursday. So, watch out for that. Alright, let's get into these questions. It might be kind of difficult for me to answer questions, read from my computer, and do my makeup at the same time. I'm not the best multitasker when it comes to all of this. My best friend from high school got me this mug, and Eric got the Mr. Mug, and it is so cute. I've got coffee in it right now, and she also bought me this little thing back there that you can see. It says Happy New Year, and it lights up, but um, I just have to get an extension cord because I don't have a plug near there, and that's where I want to put it. So anyway, let's start with the questions. Let me get some primer out. Okay, so I got some primer, and by the way, I just want to say I've been loving this primer. It is the Hard Candy Longwear Primer, 12-hour um, primer. I've been actually really loving it, and it's not that expensive. So anyway, aside from makeup, <clears throat> what is your full name? My full name is Colleen Catherine Snyder. Um, that's it. <laughs> What's the next question? What does your name mean? I know that Colleen means, um, I think, girl in Irish, um, and I don't know, I think Snyder is like German or something, um, and then Catherine is my mom's middle name, well, yeah, Mary, yeah, um, so I think that's why I have the name Catherine, and it's my middle name, but that's all I know. Are you named after anyone? I don't know, I've heard some stories that I am, but I don't know for sure, so... Does your name make any interesting anagrams? I haven't really thought about that. I don't think so. Yeah, I don't I don't think so. <laughs> wow, this is going really well so far. <laughs> um if you had if you had to change your first name, what would you change it to? Hmm. Whenever I played house with um like my friend from high school, Dakota, if you're watching this. Um, we used to change our names all the time. And I feel like my name was always Brooke, or her name was always Brooke. We always loved the name Brooke. So I think I would love to change my name to Brooke, actually. And I actually work with a Brooke, so she, I don't think she knows that about me, but I love her name. <laughs> um... Where did you grow up? I grew up in a really small town southwest of here. I'm not going to triangulate my location because this is the internet. Um, but my graduating class was 26, so it was a very small town, and I just loved growing up there. Um, and now I live in like more of a city, so it's definitely something to get used to. But um, that's where I grew up, just in a really, really small rural area. And it was a lot of fun. I absolutely loved everything about growing up in a small town now that I've experienced both small and larger schools. <laughs> what did you look like? Oh, what did you look up? <laughs> oh, sorry. Who did you look up to growing up? <clears throat> um, my brother, Jonathan. I just wanted to be just like my big brother. Um, he's my half-brother, but I never thought of him as a half-brother, and I just always missed him when he was gone, and he was, like, he was just my everything when I grew up, and I always looked up to him. Um, what are your favorite things about yourself? This is a really hard, this is hard. Um, I probably, I really like my eyes. 
um, and I like my drive because when it comes to like working out and stuff like that I'm really good at pushing myself to the next level let's see <laughs> What is your eye color? These are very basic questions. Um, my eye color is, on my license, is hazel. Um, and I agree with that. Sometimes they're more green. But I do think they are, like, purely hazel. So, hazel. What's your favorite color? My favorite color is green. I love green and not just any green. I love lime green. It's one of my favorite colors. And that's what I painted while well, I like talked my parents into painting my room lime green when I was younger. And oh, I think I just used the wrong color. <gasps> See, this is why I struggle. I just used fair and I'm not fair right now. So I'm just gonna try to darken it a little bit. The eyes are okay. Oops. Um, yeah, lime green is my favorite color for sure. Let's see. Oh, now I'm like dabbing my eyes. I can't read anything. Oh, this is way too light for me. Oops. My bad. This is why I shouldn't do makeup while I'm just talking to myself. It's weird because I feel like I always talk to myself when I do makeup, but when I'm actually talking to a camera and doing makeup, I can't do it. But look how bright that is. <clears throat> it's okay. We can make it work. We can make it work. Okay, next question. Oh my goodness, this is so light. It's okay. It's okay, it's okay. Next question. <laughs> what is your favorite drink? That's a hard one because I want to say water because it's the only thing I drink, but everybody will be like, really? Water is your favorite drink? Um, so I'm going to go with coffee. I love coffee in the morning. Um, and I just like black coffee in the morning, so... That's probably my favorite drink that I have all the time, aside from water. What is your favorite snack? My favorite snack is good beans. Probably good beans. They are dried um, roasted chickpeas, and um, they're just my favorite snack. They're nice and salty, and whoa, look at my face. This is way too light for me. Like I said, it's way too light, but I'm going to make it work. Um, so, yeah, chickpeas is my favorite snack. Okay, next question. What is your favorite way to pass time? I don't know. Like, I feel like that's changed over the years. I used to hate reading. Now I absolutely love to read when I have time. Um, so I'm going to have to go with reading right now or watching a TV show because I do love to watch TV and just sit there and do nothing and just watch other people live their lives. I like sitcoms, so <laughs> I'm sure we'll probably get to that question. <clears throat> what is your favorite candle scent? My favorite candle scent of all time, and I know a lot of people also love this scent, is um, the campfire is um campfire fireside i think that it's called i don't even know what it's called i just buy it um by uh bath and body works but i feel like those candles run out so fast um but i still absolutely love them and i feel like everybody loves that scent it's just a good mix <clears throat> are you scared of heights i am not afraid of heights um but sometimes sometimes I am. I don't really know. Maybe now I am, um, but I used to love roller coasters when I was little. Um, I really want to go like skydiving and um, zip lining and things like that. So I'm looking forward to doing all of those things. But then when I see somebody like doing something in a movie or even those Facebook things where people are like. Um, doing something really crazy up super high makes me nervous so I don't know I don't think I am I would say no but um, when I do watch like videos of it it kind of makes my stomach drop a little bit 
Are you a dog person or a cat person? If you know me, you know this answer. I am definitely a dog person. I have two dogs and you'll probably see them running around in the background. Maybe I'll insert a picture of them right now. Um, the first one's name is my dog that I came into um, Ericanized relationship with and his name is Marvel and he's a Bichon Freeze. And then I have um, a boxer which was Eric's dog before me and her name is Autumn. <clears throat> and she is just the sweetest little thing. <laughs> Are you a good cook? Um, I like to think I'm a good cook. I haven't really gotten it yet, but I am a really good baker. I love to bake. Um, so cooking, I don't know yet. It's going to be a little bit of time. Um, I just want to get kind of like some recipes down. But I think when I do bake, they do come out really good. So I would say kind of. Can you close your eyes and raise your eyebrows? I don't think I've ever tried to do this. I mean, am I doing it? Oh, and this reminds me, like, an interesting thing about me that I never knew existed is that I can't, um, wink. And I've tried this, and I feel like I can wink, it just doesn't look like a normal wink. But this is my wink, like, so. So, tell me if this is a real wink or not. Ready? Like, I feel like... The whole side of my face lifts up, but I feel like it's still working. So now I have a video of me winking so I can actually see what it looks like. But that's how I wink, and I cannot not move my mouth area when I'm winking. So, I don't know. Eric makes fun of me for it, but I don't think it's that bad. We'll have to see when I watch this video back. Do you believe in love at first sight? I would say I believe in attraction at first sight. But love, no, not love, but definitely attraction. Um, I think that love, now that I'm older, takes time and effort and um, just, like, you have to get to know somebody to, like, really fall in love with them. Um, so I believe in attraction at first sight, and sometimes people can look at that and think that they're in love. So I'm going to say... No. How many relationships have you been in? Relationships? I don't really know. I think, like, really relationships that actually lasted quite a while, I would say I've been in probably four relationships. I am almost 30. It will be 30 next year. Well, you're watching this, so I'll be 30 this year. Um, so four relationships by the time I'm 30 and they were pretty serious um, but obviously only one relationship really matters and that is the one with me and Eric and right now I just could not be happier but you guys all know that if you saw my engagement video um, Eric and I are very very happy together oh I forgot to do my brows another reason why I can't do makeup and talk to a camera at the same time I'm just doing like a really, really quick look today because I don't want this video to be hella long. Um, but let's go down to some more funner questions. What time is your usual bedtime? I go to bed at around 8.30 every night. Um, that's because I wake up at 4.30 to go to the gym before I go to my actual job. So in order for me to have time to do that, I have to wake up at 4.30. Er, um, so for those reasons, I go to bed at 8.30 because I still need a good eight hours of sleep or I will be just so miserable um, in the morning. So that's why I go to bed so early. But when I don't wake up early, I probably go to bed like on a Friday night if I'm not working. I'm waking up early to go to the gym in the morning. I probably go to bed at around 10-ish or 10.30. It just depends um, because I will sleep in until about 7.30 or 8 o'clock that day. So there, not too bad. 
And I think I will do one more question because I'm pretty much finished with my makeup. I know it was super quick, but I'm just doing some makeup to get me through the day. Um, so let's find a good one. What is the last thing you watched on TV? Um, I just finished watching an episode like a couple hours ago with Eric of Californication. We are almost finished with the whole series. And if you haven't seen Californication, I think it's hilarious. It's originally a Showtime show, um, but it's on Netflix. And I think it's so funny. Um, if you like that sort of um, show, it's definitely has, it's definitely a Showtime show. It has a lot of risque things in it, um, but I think it's hilarious. So that's what I was watching. And then when Eric and I aren't watching a show together, I'm finishing up Pretty Little Liars. I'm almost done. And I don't really know still how I feel about this show, but that is what I'm watching right now. But I think my favorite show of all time is, people are going to laugh at me, but it's Vampire Diaries for sure. I love Vampire Diaries and I just, I need to watch it again because I just love those kind of TV shows. So that's it. That's all I have for you guys. I just wanted to do a little bit of Q&A so you can get to know me a little bit more and I'll see you in my next video. Bye guys.